fans suspicious that Hybe led Isba hate train after internal documents get leaked. On October 24, 2024, Hybe COO Kim Tai Ho participated in an audit with the National Assembly. During the audit, internal documents were shown, which not only pertained to Hybe's groups but also included remarks about other companies' groups. A particular document caught the eye of many. The document titled Music Industry Report was shown during the audit. One portion of the report highlighted a group from SM Entertainment that fans have recognized and named as ESPA due to the contextual clues, despite the name being redacted for privacy. The 1st of June 2022. All this time, regarding a redacted S live singing skills, fans have been using this argument as a shield, claiming that they are good but the company does not let them do so, but it all crumbled at redacted. Now, their lip syncing has become an issue again, and the fans are redirecting hate towards other directions rather than at the group itself. We think that SM fandoms are really fast at redirection and distracting from the issue for sure. The company has to be the villain in order to protect the members completely. It seems like in order to deal with the vibes of how they are falling relatively while other fourth-generation girl groups are rising, blaming the company seems to be the easiest way. It seems as if Hybe staff were acutely aware of the hate that ESPA had received at the time of their Coachella performance. It took place in April 2022, while the report was dated June 2022. Although the document only seemed to take note of the reaction and controversy that ESPA underwent, Fans have grown suspicious that the company might have been behind the hate Ispa received. Hybe seeing how Ispa escaped from the hate train that they created, and now is one of the most famous groups with four consecutive eras being successful. So Hybe behind Coachella, girls hate train for Ispa. I wonder what they felt after Ispa released Spicy, and reversed the public opinion in their favor again. Not Hybe running the huge Ispa Coachella negative media play, just for their own GG to do the worst out of all years later. Hybe previously denied accusations in a now-deleted statement. They claimed that the report had only served to provide information internally about how fandoms run on social media.